hey, welcome to this video, which is a follow-up to the proliferator video that we put together yesterday. There's actually an interesting technique where you can in proliferate the proliferate to get more material out of it. So I'll explain the concept first, right? So now if we take one of these default proliferates that are not boosted, so these are just a normal proliferate, right? Um, we'll let this auto save pass. Um, and then stick this into here, we get 12 reserves, right? Now, what we're doing over here is that we're taking the unproliferated proliferate and proliferating it, right? So we're spraying the proliferate on itself. So if we take one of those, right? And stick it into here we get 13 reserves right so there's a little bit of a bonus however right if you think about this for mac one by default we get 12 sprays right now if we proliferate the proliferate it provides 13 sprays i'm going to assume that it rounds down from 13 and a half right so one proliferate can spray 13 others giving them an extra 13 sprays so you didn't really get anything out of it right like it's net neutral but this will get a lot better with um, Mark II. So I'm going to put that demonstration together um, and then we'll keep recording or keep talking in the video. Okay, the second one is where we start to see bonuses. So I'm going to clean these out for you so like, you don't think that I'm cheating, right? So if we pick one of these, right, which is not proliferated and we stick it into here, we get 24, right? If we take one of these boosted ones and we stick it in, we get 28, right? So the, the way it works is that if you look at these things here, it says plus we'll get an extra number of sprays as proliferate, which is 20%, right? So, oops, if we look at the numbers here, so by default you get 24 sprays, then you multiply by 1.2 by 20% you get 28 sprays. Now we get pretty badly shafted here on the rounding, right? Like we lose 0.8 when the benefit is only four. So it's nearly 20% lost due to rounding, but you know, we have to do it. Um, uh, it is what it is, right? So then to understand whether there's a bonus, right? One proliferate can spray 28 others, giving them an extra 112 sprays. So there is a small bonus, and the bonus can be calculated um, sprayed. Um, in total, the sp sprayed, you get 28 times 28, which is 784 sprays from 29 mark to proliferate, right? So we've only accounted for 28, and then added one more here to account for that that's the one that we spent to spray the proliferate right if we didn't spray we would get 29 times 24 which is 696 sprays from 29 mark to proliferate right so this is the default so by proliferating the proliferate there's a bonus um, of about 88 sprays that you get or 3.67 extra proliferate that are not boosted so that have 24 sprays so we get about a 13 percent boost now this is a small boost but i think it's a pretty good boost next we'll look at the mac 3 where i expect that the percentage boost is a lot bigger all right so now we've done the mac 3 let's clean this out um, so what we'll do is we'll take the one of these put them in here which gets us 60 right um, and then if we take one of these boosted ones here, okay, that one isn't the one that I wanted. So let's pick, let's try again. You can tell up here because um, it has like the, it, it has the, it only had two triangles when I needed three. So let's pick this one. So from that we get 75, right? So there's clearly a bonus. Um, the max here is that by default each Mark three proliferate sprays 60 sprays, right? Now with the 25 boost that we get from here, right? The extra products plus 25%. That means that we get an extra um, 15 sprays in this case, an extra 25%. So if we calculate the bonus is that 
one proliferate can spray 75 adders, right? You're giving them an extra 1,125 sprays. So there's quite a bit of a bonus. So in total, if you spray, you get 75 times 75, which is 5,625 sprays from 76 Mach 3 proliferate, right? This includes the one that we use to spray the 75. Now, if instead of doing that, we just used the default 76 and got 60 sprays out of them, we'd be getting 4,560 sprays from 76 Mach 3 proliferate, right? So that the bonus, so the difference between these two is about 1,065 or about 17.75 extra proliferate that you get, which is about a 23% boost, which is really good, right? So by the time you get to Mach 3, you definitely want to use proliferated proliferates to spray rather than the default. And because you actually get 23% more sprays using this method compared to default. So yeah, that's um, why this sort of arrangement here is um, quite important uh, or gets you a lot of benefits in terms of extra sprays rather than just using the default um, proliferate. So, you know, before we were, um, I didn't include that in here, so I probably should do that um, and incorporate it into this endpoint here. There should just be a feedback loop so that the proliferated proliferators, Mark III proliferators, end up going into the transportation hub rather than the unproliferated ones. Um, so I'm going to put that together, um, just one second, and then um, I'll check back in with you. Here we go. This is the sort of final form of the proliferate production, which will get us benefits down here as well, of course, in the earlier ones. So I've deleted all of the earlier proliferate. Um, so now we are actually getting the 25% boosted proliferators in here. And the other thing that I'll do um, is actually copy this in um, and uh, actually I need I'll, I'll save the blueprint and um, you know I'll make it available in the description as well so thank you for watching and until next time bye